In this video, I'll be demonstrating the flow of the core cardiovascular exam, featuring proper communication with the patient, draping and positioning, assessment of the radial dorsalis pedis and posterior tibial pulses, assessments for edema, evaluation of the JVP, carotid auscultation, and cardiac auscultation. For a detailed discussion of these techniques and the possible pathologic findings one might encounter, as well as discussion and demonstration of specialized cardiovascular maneuvers that are only indicated in certain situations, please see other videos in this series, the links to which are in this video's description. Hello, my name is uh, Eric Strong. I'm a physician here at Stanford. And um, how would you like to be addressed today? You can call me Radhika. Radhika, it's very nice to meet you. I understand you're here for the cardiovascular exam. Yes, I am. Okay, well, thank you very much for being here. Um, is it okay if I ask you a few questions before we start? Yeah. Do you have a, a past medical history of anything involving your heart or your blood vessels? Uh, no. And have you ever had any procedures on your heart? No, I have not. Okay. And can you give me the, the, uh, an idea of what's the most physically strenuous thing you do in a typical week? Um, twice a week I work out with uh, my physical trainer, so we're doing some strength training, and that's pretty strenuous. Okay. Right, well, that sounds good. Mm -hmm. Sounds very like uh, keeping active. and Yeah, it feels good. 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 I'm glad to hear that. I was asked you about a couple of symptoms just to see if you've been experiencing these in the last few weeks or, or month or so. Um, any shortness of breath? No. Any chest pain? No. Any lightheadedness? No. Any uh, sensation that your heartbeat was unusually fast or irregular? Uh, no. Okay. Any swelling in your legs? No. Okay. Well, I'm glad to hear that. It sounds like you've been feeling pretty healthy. Is that an accurate assessment? Yeah, yeah pretty much. Okay. Well, great. Is it okay if we get started? Yes, absolutely. Thank you. Do you have any questions before we begin? No, thank you. Okay. Radhika, we're going to start with uh, feeling the pulse in your wrist. Okay. Can I get to see your hand here? Yes. Okay. Pulse feels normal. Okay. At this point, I'm going to lay the bed down almost flat and then take a look at some pulses in your legs. Sounds good. Lie back, and I'm going to extend the leg rest out here. Right now, I'm feeling for some pulses in your feet and ankles. And I'll be checking for some swelling. Radhika, next, I'd like to take a look at a vein in your neck um, that's going to help us to estimate the pressures in your heart. Gotcha. Thank you. Can you turn your head a little bit to the left? And I'm going to push on your stomach for a moment. and your pressure looks normal. Next, I'm gonna take a listen to some arteries on either side of your neck. Radhika, next I'm going to listen to your heart with a stethoscope. Um, I'm going to listen at two parts, two points higher up and two parts lower down. For the higher up parts, do you mind if I untie your gown and then you can lower the gown to the upper part of the breasts? Uh, yeah. Is that okay? No problem. Yeah. Okay. And just, just a little bit below the collarbone.
And radical, you can uh, raise your gown back up okay. to your neck. And I'm now going to need you to raise the gown up to just underneath your bra. Mm -hmm. um, I'm going to hold the sh sheet in place. Okay. And you can lift up the gown for you. Great. Okay. Yes. And do you mind just um, holding your left breast up? That's perfect. Thank you. You can lower your gown back down, and I can like, hold the sheet. I'm going to lower it all the way. Oh, thank you. Radhika, I'm going to raise your bed back up again, all the way. Okay. And I'm going to push this in. Would you like me to retie your gown on the back? No, I'm good. Thank you. All right. Well, Radhika, I'm very happy to say that your uh, cardiovascular exam is completely normal. Great. Thank you. Do you have any questions for me? No, I'm relieved. Thank you very much. You're very welcome. If I was describing Radica's cardiovascular exam during an oral presentation, I would summarize it as follows. Radica has a regular rhythm with a normal S1 and S2. There were no murmurs or gallops. JVP was normal. There were no carotid bruises. Her right radial and bilateral dorsalis pedis and posterior tibial pulses were all normal. And she has no peripheral edema.